Hey, happy sunshine family. <clears throat> it's 10 after 2 in the afternoon on the 20th of September, 2017. We're taking a look here at the IntelliCast and National Radar composite images. And I figured we'd independently take a look at them full screen for a little while. See if anything's changed. Find out what's going on. Wow, look right in the middle of Mississippi. This humongous storm is forming. Right in the center of the state. And I noticed that there's an arc of four radar centers, uh, two in Alabama and two in Georgia, that appear to be forming pretty much a line right towards the center of this storm that's popping up in Mississippi. Hurricane Jose is I mean, I just want to call it Storm Jose at this point. Uh, let's switch over to the IntelliCast feed. And find out what we got going on along the coast here where it's just starting to make landfall. All right, Buzzards Bay, Massachusetts at 4.55 p.m. East Coast time. So these are fairly current times, or fairly current readings. Wind speed, 17 miles an hour. Dartmouth, or Dartmouth. 15 miles an hour, 4.53 p.m. Nantucket is 31 miles an hour. Block Island, 23 miles an hour. Let's head on down to the islands. and see what we've got going on as far as Hurricane Maria goes. Yeah, apparently Puerto Rico is getting hit by some weather today and it's not showing on any of the reflective radar. This is playing right now if we overlay NASA's satellite, it shows that this storm is right over the top of Puerto Rico, right in between Puerto Rico and uh, Haiti and the DR here. And nothing showing up on reflective radar. And I wonder why. There's a lot of radar installations that would have had to have been taken out. It's not just one, one radar. I mean, surely any radar installations over here are going to pick up the storm or the rain bands. We're, we're in an information blackout, guys. All right, so this is your mid-afternoon peek at the radar. We'll be back more soon. Um, and I, I've got a new microphone set up right now, so with any luck, uh, this will be a good stopgap until... And I'm just waiting on some different cables and adapters, but I've got a workaround for right now. Um, yeah, I love you guys a lot. Thank you for all the emails, the love, the light, and the links. We'll be back soon.